Cardinal Richelieu. Yes, Majesty. That, um, that thing we were talking about earlier, yes. could you explain it to me again in, in as much detail as possible? <laughs> no problem at all, Majesty. Are you ready? Yes, yes, completely ready. Yes. Then here we go. Yes. <clears throat> you are the King of France. Ah, <laughs> yeah. No, still not getting it. Oh, let me put it the other way. Um, imagine that this apple is France. Oh, okay, yes, I'm imagining. Good. I can see the apple. Yes. Yes, that is the green thing. It's yes. the green yes. thing. And what's the orange thing? It's an orange. Yes, I knew that. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, imagine that the apple belongs to you. Oh, yes, yes. yes. Uh, and just as the apple belongs to you, so does France. Ah. Yes, you can open your eyes now. Thank you. Ah, yes, jolly good. Well, uh, thanks for going through all that again. Yes. Not at all, yes. Will there be any other questions? Uh, yeah, um, king? A monarch. Oh, the ruler of the nation, if you will. Uh, France? <sighs> the third largest country in Europe, extending 600 miles from Flanders down to the Spanish border. Right, and I'm called Louis the Thirteenth because... Because the other 12 are dead! <laughs> wow. Bit of a coincidence, though, isn't it? 12 other people, all called Louis, and all kings of France. <laughs> yes. Will there be anything else, Highness? No, I don't think so. Oh, yes. Who's that man in the Iron Mask who keeps locked up in the dungeon? What? You know, that bloke with that little thingy padlock to his head. Well, he's, he's, he's uh, a shoplifter. Really? Yes. What did he shoplift? Uh, some towels. <laughs> a bit harsh, isn't it? They were really nice towels. <laughs> Fair enough. So there's no truth in the rumour that he's actually my identical twin brother? No! Or that you are plotting to have me killed and become king yourself? It is utter nonsense, Majesty. <laughs> oh, go on, Richard. You tell me honestly. Do you want a princely rank? <laughs> I'm not exactly sure how to answer that. But it is true that at a secret meeting with the English Prime Minister, you described me as an intellectual dickwad. Who told you that? I have an ear in every corner, you know. Really? Yes, it's a medical condition. I must get the royal physician to do something about it. Well, maybe you should go along and do that now, Highness, yes? Oh, okay, um, what are you going to do? I have some death warrants to sign. Oh, okay, well, see you later. As you please, Majesty. And the first warrant I shall sign will be yours, Louis. <laughs> <coughs> I, I'm still here, Gardner. <laughs>